shadows no longer. Blood shall be shed and my purpose fulfilled. Fifteen years together, and this is where it comes to. Unbelievable. She wants to throw me out. Bullshit! After all these years, this is what it comes down to. She'll come back. Once I get my money. Oh, shit! Don't stare down the enemy, kid. It's an easy way to get one right between the eyes. Lucky it's not hunting season, pal. So you're man enough to call me and not face me, huh? Boy, just come back to town. Let's talk man to man. No, 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 no. Listen to me. You want to lay with my girl? Get me kicked out of my house? Listen, man, fuck you! Fuck me? You weren't good to her, Roy. I treat her good. You what? You were good to her. Trust me when I tell you, everybody in this fucking town has had a piece of that ass. Listen, Roy, I'll face you if you want me to face you. It doesn't have to be that way. I'm not coming back. And guess what? Trailing me or something, bro? What are you talking about? You're out there. You better show your face. Roy, what are you talking about? I'm back in town. Listen, I'm not coming back. And I don't give a fuck about Veronica. She's your problem now. Yo, Roy, just come back. Stop to worrying about me and focus on your fucking self. Roy. You're scaring away my fucking face. Ah! So well, was already going to play our band. You there, Yellow? Is our air time coming up? It didn't miss it, right? I was really into writing this new song. <laughs> no, you didn't miss it. Either. You're killing it with that guitar, girl. <laughs> oh, what the hell? Damn it. It's because we're on the countryside now. Signal isn't going to pick out out here.
Why, why did we do this again? To get away from it all. And you're the one that's always wanted to be with nature and whatnot. And I thought it would have been a good idea for your songwriting. Oh shit. <sighs> Alright, just play cool. Just go back. Hey, kid. How you doing tonight? Very well. Is there a problem, officer? Well, maybe. You wouldn't be trying to go camping up at the Will campsite, would you? As a matter of fact, we were. If there's no problem, officer, we'd like to get going. Well, there is a problem, you see. I'm trying to do you all a favor. We got us an investigation going up at the Will campsites. Investigation of murder. A few of them. Really? What happened? Ma'am, can you step out of the vehicle for me, please? What's the point? I'll ask some questions around here, son. You kids getting into some drugs tonight? No, she was born that way, man. It's true. I was born with those yellow eyes. So you're sick? No, I feel fine. It's just something I'm stuck with. I was adopted, so... I'm not sure if it's genetic or what, but it's me nonetheless. And everyone accepts her as is. I see. My apologies then. Listen up. The name is Murphy Kevster. Folks around here call me Officer Kev. I pulled you over because we don't want anybody going up to the Willow campsites. There was a bear or a rabid wolf attack or something. Found a poor man torn to shreds just this morning. Officer Kev. Took you long enough. I see you have some stragglers here tonight. <laughs> I'm Marvin Finnegan. And how are you all doing tonight, young lady? And those eyes. Marvin here is going to take you to the safer campsites over yonder. He's been deputized by me for the evening to assist with the situation yeah follow me please that's weird as hell yeah but at least we still get to camp that cop could have sent us back in. Hey! I think we're settled for the evening here. You can head back to the officer if you want. Uh, that sounds good, honey. But I'll leave when I'm good and ready. Yeah. Don't mind that. You're gonna have a good time. You want to show me that song you were writing? Thanks, please. So, this really came to me as soon as we left the city. Being the outcast, you know. When you feel something. Like being out here. I feel like I belong. You know? Let's talk. More singing yellow.
Pack your shit, kids. We're out of here. Have you lost your mind, man? What are you? I hit him. He shot. He? He, the wolf. Pack your shit. We have to get out of here. <laughs> Come on, we gotta go! Yellow, oh. come on! Oh, father. Let's go, we have to move! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go. Calm down now. Where's all happy? You gotta save my friend, please, please, please. He happened this way. And you saw this boy. It was it was almost like it was quite human. Alright, alright, show me where it is. Well, good morning, darling. What? What is this, you bastard? No, it's a real shame you had to see Talos. I don't want to do this, but he's really testing my patience tonight. Are you crazy? Let me go! All right, darling. Showtime. What? 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 What the hell is this? Don't even try to run. Alright. You have my attention. She's here. Wait! Oh my god! I know you're there, Talos. Come on out! Show yourself! You know, you're really pissing me off, so we can the tantrum. We're happy to keep it a low profile. We're getting out of here, come on. Where are you two gonna go? We're getting the fuck out of here, you psycho. See you, kids. This one here is Talos. He's one from my pack. Poor guy's been having visions. Something about a chosen one and a prophecy. You're crazy. The sacred phrase can only be used once every generation. Otherwise, the Lycan leader spirit gets locked away for another hundred years or so. Poor Talos here has been killing like a maniac, just trying to appease our Lycan gods. You worship werewolves? <laughs> he actually thought you were the chosen one. Over me. The Pack Alpha. And no, honey, we don't worship werewolves. We are them. And we prefer the term liking, if you will. We're getting out of here. You better fucking run!
why we're just normal people. We didn't want any of this. He is a normal person, but you, I see you in my dreams. I can see the light in, in your eyes. It is not a deformity. And you've proven yourself worthy. I saw in my visions one with an estranged past, an outcast of the years. As fate would have it, you arrived here. I have shed much blood to appease the lichen gods. You, Sybil, the lichen spirit is dormant just beyond your eyes. The prophecy says the one who bears this mark has the ferocity to defeat an alpha lichen back leader, even in human form. And you did so without Alpha Kev. All that remains is a sacred passage, and your true destiny will be revealed. I don't know what. This is where you belong. Spiritus Otum Lupum Revelare Spiritus Otum Lupum Revelare Veram Toaintan In Sequis Es Dignes This isn't you. Allow us to destroy this weak attachment. And you will be a part of a real family. A true acceptance of yourself. Sybil. Look at them. You're not one of them. No, Blaze. You're the one who's not one of us. This is where I belong. This is where I was always meant to be. I'm so sorry, please.